Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So you'll probably notice that today I am filming in my closet and that's because I have some clothing items for you. Um, so this is going to be some things that I picked up throughout the month of January and February. Um, just some loungewear type workout or just relaxing around the house items. Um, none of this is thrifted. This is all either Walmart or Victoria's Secret. Um, mostly Walmart. And I am going to just get into it now and show you guys. So I'm going to start with the Victoria's Secret things. I went at the end of the semi-annual sale, and these aren't clothing, but I did pick up some perfumes because these were like $2 and change. So the ones I picked up, I picked up Temptation, which is like an apple and something else type scent. Sheer Love, which you can see I really like. This is a cotton and lily scent. I picked up two blush because this is my favorite. This is magnolia flower and grapefruit, so it's just really fresh and clean. And then the last one is bombshell. And this actually wasn't supposed to be in that bin because it's normally an $18 one, and these are normally $10. Um, same size, but I guess because this is one of their fancy ones. But because it was in there and there was a couple other high-end ones in there, she gave it to me for like the $2. So this one, it's called bombshell. You would think it'd be like really like kind of like sultry and stuff, but to me this just smells like soap. It smells like fresh and clean. So that's one of the reasons why I like it. I did pick up a couple of shirts, and these were the reason I actually went in there. Pink does these promotions, and that is like one of the only times other than thrifting that I'll buy the clothes there because they're just really expensive. So these shirts were normally $36.90 something, so about $37. They put them on a promotion for $20, so I just picked up two. And they're the super soft, just pink super soft tees. Now this one I picked up in a medium. And it's just a black v-neck and it's got these crisscrosses in the front. So it dips kind of low. So I picked up a sports bra to go under it to kind of like show off. And this is the one I picked, a high neck one. And I just love how it's got like the mesh and then the backs is pink. So this is kind of like a dual use. This part here is the one you'll see with the one with the low V front. And then this other super soft tee I got is a size small. And this one just says the pink thing on the front. And then the back has a low dip. So in this one you'll see the back. And then this I picked up at the semi-annual sale for like $12. So just some things that I can wear relaxing around the house or even going to the gym. Now the rest of the stuff I'm going to show you is from Walmart, and there's a couple of different lines I picked things up from. So I'm going to start with the Danskin things. I found this Danskin sweater on sale for $9, and it's just like a really soft, thin, slouchy fit, and then it's got the little zippers at the bottom, and then it's got the little thumb holes in the sleeves, so you can kind of like pull it down to cover your hands. And in this shirt... I bought a large for a nice slouchy fit, and I like everything to be like baggy or loose when it's like a workout or like a comfort wear, so I most everything's going to be like a medium or a large just so that it's comfortable. Um, the next shirt, I actually picked up two of these because I loved it and I was afraid I would stain it, and it's just this baseball tee from Danskin, and these were like $5.97 I think. And it says loose fit. I really don't think it's a loose fit, so I did go up to a large in this. And just for like a reference, normally if I wore like a dress, like an actual dress from the store, I'd probably wear a six-ish. Um, so that gives you kind of like a reference point if you're around that, you know, you could, what size you could fit. Um, so then I went online and probably not a good thing to do because that's like that's my weakness when it comes to shopping and I found all these new uh, new things out from No Boundaries which is like one of the junior lines at Walmart and it looks so much like Victoria's Secret Pink um, so I picked up quite a bit of stuff from that and I'm gonna show you guys them now so the first I'm wearing actually is one of these shirts and I will just show you guys it's a baggy fit this is a medium I could have gone to a small definitely but it's got like the seams here, and then if you look across the back, it's got the seam exactly like the Victoria's Secret ones, so very similar. And these were like $11, and I picked this up in two other colors. As of when I bought them, those were the only three colors they had, so they also have it in a white. 
with like a neon emblem. And then they have it in this really pretty mint green. And that's just got a black emblem. And they all have that little like hockey jersey seaming across the back. Um, now just a word of caution, these ones that are bright colors, they did say to wash them alone for the first time. So they may bleed. So I did that. I put it in it on its own so I can't really tell you. Um, I picked up two hoodies. Okay, so now I've got the hoodies to show you guys. I actually uh, paused it to get the hoodies and then I must have taken it out of shooting mode somehow so I just filmed this whole end of the video but not really filmed it. So let's do this a second time. So the first hoodie is this one here and it's gray with the white on top and then it's just got like that neon sign on it. And this one I went for the medium in because this one runs really baggy. Um, and I don't know if you guys would be interested maybe Maybe at the end I'll put in like a little try-on thing, so that way if you guys wanted to find any of these in your store or online, you would have like an idea. Um, now, this one, like I said, I went in the medium. That one also was like 13 online. This next one was on sale online. This one I went to a large in because it ran a little bit smaller. So it's just got like the half zip down the middle. It's got the pouch pocket in the front. It's got the heathered look, and then it's just got a little uh, thing there. And these are really thin sweatshirts, so they're not something you'd wear outside to be like warm, but inside they're like perfectly cozy. And then the last three items are pants that I picked up in the store, and that will be the end of all this workout stuff. Um, stay tuned at the end, I'll stick in little uh, inserts of me trying stuff on if you're interested in seeing how it fits. So. Let's see, these are navy blue, and they just have a logo down the side. These I picked up in large, so I'd get like that baggy slouchy fit, and they were $10. The next pants are also $10. Actually, they're all 9 dollars but I rounded up. And it's just this gray pair, and then the bottoms are white, and the back is just all gray. And then the last pair is this black pair, and they say love on the side, and then some banding on the bottom. And they had, in my store, at least one other color. It was like a maroon, um, but I'm trying to stick to just like the basic colors that I can mix with all the pieces in my closet. So that is my workout and loungewear haul. Stay tuned if you guys want to see like the try-on portion. Um, thanks for watching. Alright, so this is that blue shirt that I showed you guys and I got this in two other colors I'm obviously only going to show you the one all right and then here you can see that sweatshirt that I got in a large and it's got plenty of extra space I mean so I could have sized down if I wanted but I was going for comfort and slouchy and then the pants ones that say love on the side and then the hem with just the stripes And this is that gray hoodie in a medium, so it goes long enough that you could actually wear it with leggings, it'll cover your bottom. But this is just to show you like the idea of, I mean honestly I probably could have gone small in this too, but I don't know, I just wanted it slouchy and comfy. So, and this is how those baseball t-shirts fit. And I just love this one. It reminds me of the Magnolia Market one that has like the emblem on it. So until I can get that one, this is going to have to do. And these were like $5.90 something I remember saying to you guys. So this is how this one fits. And I bought this in a large. And this is that dance skin sweater that I love. It's just the long length, really soft. The zips here, they have um, fabric under them. So, I mean, you could undo it. I like them done up. And I know I got this mainly for lounging, but I've actually worn it to work with a skirt already. And then here's those little uh, thumb holes so it pulls the fabric down over your hands. And I did find this one on a clearance rack, so if you guys are looking, that's where you should check. They had it in a few other colors, but only this one in the size I wanted. 
And then here is that pink super soft top that I love. Um, I've worn it a couple times actually already. I actually wore it to work even though I know it's like an exercise thing. With a skirt it looks really cute. So you can see like the mesh from the sports bra still kind of pops out. The shirt here has the crisscrosses. I like that the sleeves are fitted even though the rest of the shirt is baggy because it gives it kind of like a, a polished look. And it hits about a little bit lower than your hips. So I mean you could wear it with leggings if you wanted. But um, I wore it with a skirt and I thought it was really cute. And it does come in some other colors. I know there was white, pink, and purple. If it goes on sale again, I might actually go back and get the pink one. And then this is that other pink top. And it's just got the logo here. Um, you can see the mesh sports bra again, but the back is, this, is what's cool on this one. So you can see actually the pink on the sports bra part of this. And this one I haven't worn as much yet. Actually, I don't think I've worn it yet. No, but it's still tagged. Um, it's just not as versatile as the black one, but come spring I'll be able to wear this more. And this one I went for a size small. The other one I got a medium because I didn't have a small. But the small and medium are really, really similar. So if you were going to get one, either size would work. 